Queen costume wheel. Let's go! Cool! It landed on the mummy. That means we're going to make Coach Rocco a mummy costume. Coach Rocco's been a little sad lately because he doesn't have a Halloween costume ready this year. <laughs> but don't worry, we're going to cheer him up. The only rule of this game is we have to use supplies that we already have. No going to the store for us. Boys and girls, if you know what to use to make a mummy costume, give me a big thumbs up. I think you know what I'm thinking. <laughs> Let's go. Jimmy, I'm going to need a lot of toilet paper. Do you know where it's all kept? I sure do. But first, what do you need it for? I can't just give you all that toilet paper for nothing. You see, I'm playing this game where I'm making DIY Halloween costumes. And I'm doing a mummy. Oh, awesome. I'll help you out. Coach Rocco keeps all the toilet paper upstairs in the closet. I'll go get it. Awesome. While Jimmy's doing that, I'm going to go to the bathroom and see if there's any extra toilet paper. Toilet paper, where are you? Oh, yeah, <laughs> got one. Huh. But this is definitely not enough for a full costume. I wonder how Jimmy's doing. Jimmy, how's it going up there? Coming. Wait till you see how much toilet paper I got. We'll have enough to make mummy costumes for everyone in school. Ellie? Jimmy? Uh-oh. Ah! Uh Okay, Coach Rocco, are you ready to get your Halloween costume on? All you have to do is pose like this. Wait, where did you get all this toilet paper? Did you get into the closet again, Jimmy? Sorry, but everyone knows that mummies don't talk. This is going to be totally worth it. Boys and girls, if you want to see me and Jimmy wrap up Coach Rocco like a mummy, give us a big thumbs up. Are you ready? One, two, three, go! Let's do this. Pretty good, right, Jimmy? Yeah. I think we are done. Awesome. How do you like your costume, Coach Rocco? You're love a mummy now. Like it? I love it. Look at my mummy walk. <laughs> Look at it. Look at your walk. Stand overboard. <laughs> you. Oh, I got it, kids. Don't worry. Don't panic. I'm a professional doggy pal. Oh, I got it. <laughs> You're going to wrap me again. I am going to go trick or treating tonight. <laughs> <laughs> now that Coach Rocco's costume is all done, it's time to spin the wheel again and see what I wear. Let's do this. It landed on the witch costume. I've always wanted to dress up as a spooky witch. Let's go find the supplies in the house. Oh, I definitely got this one. I have all the supplies you need to be a witch right over there in the barn. I'll go get them. Wait, Jimmy! The barn? <sighs> ah, the barn. This should have everything I need. Let's see. Hmm. Ah! This looks like something a witch would wear. Let's see, what else do witches wear? I need a hat. Perfect. All right, and uh, a broomstick. Witches always have broomsticks. Hmm, a baseball bat? Close enough. I told you this would be easy. Gosh, I wonder where Jimmy went off to. Here you go, Ellie. I got everything you'll need for your witch costume. Awesome! A cape? This looks perfect. I found it behind the barn door. Ooh, spooky. Ta-da! Perfect. And secondly, all witches wear hats, right? Well, this was the only hat I could find, so here you go. I mean, I guess I could be a cowboy witch. Those exist, right? And last but not least, a bat. Witches love bats, I figure. And plus, this one doubles as a broom. Oh, I see what you did there, Jimmy. I don't know, boys and girls. Do you think I look like a witch to you? No! 
wait, 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 hold on. Is it a better broom you're looking for? Because you could attach this to the end of the bat and oh. see, that looks like, it looks perfect. I mean, I, I guess so, but I don't know. I've never seen a baseball bat broomstick before. Oh, no, it looks great. Trust me, you're ready Maybe to go trick-or-treating. Maybe on this side, I don't know. Time to spin the wheel again and try another costume. One, two, three, go! It's a pirate costume! Oh, awesome! You'd make such a great pirate. I have everything you need for your costume right there in the barn. Uh, Jimmy, I actually think the pirate costume is for you. And I think I have the perfect supplies for you inside. Let's go! Look, Jimmy, I found one of Coach Rocco's favorite jackets. I'm sure he wouldn't miss it too much. Try it on. It looks super piratey. Wow. I feel like a pirate already. Oh, but you're not a pirate yet. You gotta have a hook. And I think this hanger will do just the trick. All you have to do is bend it into shape. And look, you have a hook already. Huh, a homemade hook. This is so cool. Arrgh. <laughs> okay, I think that we have to make some accessories. Come over here. Because we're going to make a pirate hat. For a pirate hat, you're going to need black construction paper, a stapler, and scissors. It's that easy. Here we go, the finished pirate hat. Doesn't it look good? Yes. But we're missing one more accessory. The pirate's eye patch. I wonder what we can use to make one of those. Oh, an, an eye patch, you say? You mean like uh, mm. this one that I found in the barn? Told you I could find anything in there. Jimmy, you're so good at finding things. Why don't you put that on and I'll put on your hat for you. This is gonna be the best pirate costume ever. Mm. Ah. Here we go. Oh, perfect fit. <laughs> This is so cool. I'm Jimmy Beard the Pirate. Arr! <laughs> you look really good. Quick, I need your help. I can't get out of this costume and I have to go to the bathroom really bad. Uh, Mr. Pirate, why don't you use that hook to help me get this toilet paper off me? Captain Jimmy to the rescue. Just hook it right there and I'll spin out. Ready? Go! <laughs> I'm all right. I, I landed on a soft spot, okay. <laughs> Don't worry about me. <laughs> At the dentist for a checkup to make sure I don't have any cavities. How's it looking there, Coach Rocco? I mean, Dentist Rocco? Up, oh, it's looking good so far, but hopefully you didn't eat too much Halloween candy like Jimmy does every year. Mmm, yum. Well, let's keep looking. All right, I'm just gonna look over here. That's looking good. How about this one over here? That one looks good. Uh, yeah, that looks good too. Uh, looking good, looking good. Congratulations, Ellie. You have no cavities. Looks like you've been brushing and flossing every day. Yep. Twice a day, once in the morning and once at night. Okay, Jimmy, now it's your turn. Uh, well, here's the thing. I already brushed my teeth this morning, so I don't need a checkup. Come on, let's go to class. Oh. Uh, don't be silly, Jimmy. Now, come on, this won't hurt a bit. You don't have to be scared. Scared? Me? This is Jimmy you're talking to, the bravest boy in class. Plus, I brought Mr. Fluffy for support. <laughs> Scared. I'll show you who's scared. All right, let's have a look. Oh, what is that tool you're using? On second thought, I'm out of here. Come on, Mr. Fluffy. Wait, Jimmy, I wasn't done. He's always running away. This happens every year at Jimmy's checkup, but don't worry. He left his Halloween candy here. We can use it to lure him back. Jimmy's gonna get his check of whether or not he wants to or not. <laughs> if you want to help find Jimmy, hit that thumbs up button. Let's go, Dentist Rocco. Jimmy, come out, come out wherever you are. 
Jimmy, I have your Halloween candy here. If you come out and do your checkup, you can have all your Halloween candy back. Jimmy? Coming through, coming through. I have the perfect plan to catch Jimmy. What do you think? Whoa, a giant beach ball? No, it's a giant hamster ball. I went ahead and put Jimmy's Halloween candy inside. See it right there. And when he comes by to get it, we'll hide and then we'll sneak up and wham, we got him. <laughs> what do you think? Well, Jimmy would do anything for his Halloween candy, so I think this is a great idea. Come on, let's go hide. Come on, this way. <laughs> This is going to be so easy. I'm like the best hide-and-seek player in the whole world. Ellie and Dentist Rocco don't stand a chance. <gasps> hey, look at that. Mm -hmm. It looks like a giant hamster ball. <gasps> oh, he's coming. It is a giant hamster ball. <gasps> and hey, look. Some of my candy's inside, too. This must be my lucky day. <laughs> Gotcha, Jimmy! Ah! <laughs> oh no! Ellie and Dentist Rocco! <laughs> oh, I guess you got me. This is a great plan, Coach Rocco. Jimmy would do anything for his candy. Yep, now we just gotta pump you up and get you back to the dentist's office. Come on! And just one more pump, Jimmy, and I'll sit. <laughs> awesome! This way to the office, Jimmy. Come on! <laughs> Right this way. That was some great teamwork, Dr. Rocco. Wait a second. I have an idea. <laughs> it's usually right. so hard to get. Jimmy! 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 Jimmy, get back here! You can't catch me. I'm hey. dead! Oh. 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 Coach! I mean, dentist! I... Yes! Jimmy! Keep going! Don't worry about me! Wahaha! <laughs> Jimmy escapes again. They have no shot of finding me. No dentist appointment for Jimmy this year. To celebrate, I'm going to take a nice, relaxing dip in the pool. Ooh. Hey, wait a second. Is that more candy? Wow, this really is my lucky day. Not only do I not have to go to my dentist appointment, but I get to eat the rest of my candy, too. Yes! Let's dive in and get it. Here comes Ooh. Jimmy. Got it. Ah. Oh, no. <laughs> no running away this time, Jimmy. All right, Jimmy, come on out of the pool. You can play hide and seek all day after your checkup. All right, fine. I just need you to help me out. All right, here, grab hold of this toothbrush. Careful, Coach Rocco. Move closer. Now, Jimmy, get closer to me. Wait, reach it. Oh, no. Jimmy! Jimmy, Jimmy! Jimmy, Jimmy. Oh, ah, 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 Jimmy, get back here. Get back here. Help me, Ellie. Oh, wait. This is also doubles as a flotation device. Oh, great! Oh, let's, so, let's oh good. Oh, thank you. No. Oh. oh, Coach. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, oh gosh. Oh. Don't fall in. Why does this keep happening to me? <laughs> Couldn't catch me at school, or in the hamster ball, or even in the pool. <laughs> I'm the best at hiding. You know, sometimes even I forget how awesome I am. And speaking of, here comes the Jimmy Spinneroony. Whoa! Did I make it? Yes! And the crowd goes wild. Jimmy, 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 Jimmy! Oh no, Ellie and Dentist Rocco. Wait, uh, you want me to teach you how to do the Jimmy Spinneroony? Nope, Jimmy, we finally caught you. And it's time for you to get your checkup, once and for all. Oh, fine. I ate all my Halloween candy anyway. So I probably have a lot of cavities. Let's just get this over with. All right, let's have a look-see. Mm. Uh... Now what's this over here? Oh, looks like you got a little uh, Halloween candy stuck up there. Not too good. Uh, what's this over here? Oh, need to floss that later. Uh-huh. Oh, looks like you got an old uh, gummy bear stuck between those teeth there. What's this over here? Over here, uh-huh, looking good. Little gummy bear right there. There we go, look at that. Looking good. Well, guess what, Jimmy? 
You've got no cavities! No cavities? Awesome! The old Jimmy Chompers are back in business, better than ever. <laughs> I told you, Jimmy. Checkups aren't so bad after all. Yes! <laughs> well, when you're a big boy like me, they're pretty easy. Especially now that I'm done, I get to do another ah! terrific Jimmy ah! Spinnerly! Jimmy! <laughs> I think I broke my tooth. and Camp Counselor Coach Rocco told us to make these giant shapes. But they're a lot heavier than I thought. I'm definitely gonna need some help. Oh, hey, Jimmy. You wanna help me carry this giant shape over to the pool? Sure thing. My name is Jimmy, you know, the strongest kid in camp. This will be a breeze. I wonder what these giant shapes are for. Hey, do you hear that? It sounds like the ice cream truck. Oh, ice cream? Um, why don't we go get a cone after our camp activity today, Jimmy? <laughs> oh, after our camp activity? But I want it now. I can't wait. Ice cream. Hold on. on. No. <laughs> uh, I guess I'm going to have to carry this all by myself. Today's challenge is jumping through impossible shapes. The rules are simple. We're going to take these shapes that you made and put them into the pool. Then each of you are gonna jump into the pool and through the shape. The one who jumps through the shape and doesn't touch the board gets a point. But if you touch the board, you get zero. Now we're gonna use this wheel to pick which shape we use first. Ready? One, two, three, spin the wheel! <laughs> yes, it landed on circle. Well, here's the circle. Ellie, would you do the honor and throw it into the pool? My pleasure, Coach Rocco. So I have to jump into the circle without touching the sides of it. I think this is going to be pretty easy, don't you? <laughs> I have my GoPro just in case I want to see what it looks like when I jump in. Bye! Ooh, it's going to look so cool. And I got my goggles. Let's put them on. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> challenge is super easy, so that's why I'm going to make it awesome with my favorite donut floaty. It's a perfect circle, so it'll fit right through the board. Oh Ready or not, here comes Jimmy! Jimmy! Oh, Jimmy! <laughs> Did I do it? Did I do it? Did I win? Oh no, Jimmy, you didn't make it through. That crack you heard oh. was you crashing through the board. You didn't make it through at all. Wait a minute, I didn't make it through? Hold on, I get a do-over. Just let me get my donut. Oh, look at this, Jimmy. Okay, and the score for round one is one Ellie, Jimmy zero. And now it's time for round two. And spin the wheel! <laughs> It landed on the person! Oh, wait till you see this one. This one's my personal favorite. <laughs> A person? It looks like he's sleeping. How are we supposed to jump through this if he's sleeping? It's gross. Jimmy's definitely got this one. I just gotta jump in there like I'm jumping into bed. Here comes Jimmy! Jimmy! I did it! 
I definitely got it this time, right? You did it, Jimmy! You jumped right through without touching the board! Great job! That was amazing! Awesome! <laughs> this was the hardest jump ever, and Jimmy got it! Woo! Nice jump, Jimmy! Now let's see if I can get through without touching the sides. This is gonna be a hard one! One, two, three, go! Ah! you touch the board that means no point for you but that does mean that you and jimmy are now tied oh i love a good competitive challenge <laughs> and now it's time for round three ellie has one jimmy has one the score is tied now let's spin the wheel <laughs> Wow, it landed on the letter B. We have to jump through shapes and letters. Yup, and here it is. Lucky for me, this is what my name starts with. Oh, I'm totally gonna win this one. Jimmy, your name starts with a J, not B, remember? J, Jimmy. J, B, what's the difference? Either way, I'm totally gonna win. <laughs> yeah. This is a tricky one. I'm gonna have to pick which loop I'm gonna have to jump through. I can pick the nearest one or the furthest one. I think I'm gonna pick the furthest one. I'm feeling extra jumpy today. Three, two, one. you could do the same? Ellie only jumped through one of the loops in the B. That's like cheating. I'm gonna jump through both loops and that'll show you who the real best jumper is. Here comes Jimmy! 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 Did you see that? I got through both loops! Jumper ever! Uh, I don't think so, Jimmy. Look how the board is all busted up. The whole challenge is, is about not touching the board. I'm afraid you don't get a point for this one. I'm not allowed to touch the board? Nobody told me that. That's not fair. I thought it was better if you touched the board. Oh, come on, give me a do-over. Let me go one more time, Coach, please. Not fair. And the score is now two Ellie, one Jimmy. It's time for round four. And spin the wheel! <gasps> awesome! It landed on the heart shape! That's my favorite shape of all time! A oh, heart? <laughs> Yuck! Huh, give me that. Favorite shape? Check. Jump and stretch. Check. Time for me to go. One, two, three. Oh, look at that perfect jump. <laughs> okay, pressure's on, Jimmy. Bet you can't get through. Please, heart shape is easy peasy. All I gotta do is turn myself into a heart shape. Ready or not, here comes Jimmy. Oh. Ah! Jimmy. Oh. Jimmy. Oh. Ah! Jimmy. I did it, world pool jumping champion. <laughs> I'm afraid not, Jimmy. You busted up the board yet again. That means Ellie has three points and you have one point, making Ellie the pool jumper 
Challenger winner! Yes! Third in the pool, Coach! I'm going to go. Where did he go? Oh. Ah! What? Right behind Did you right there. Oh, there it is. Got it! <laughs> no Jimmy. Fair. Oh my goodness, you really messed up that board good, huh? Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Give me one more try. I'll get it this time, I swear. <laughs> You're a real heartbreaker, Three, two, Jimmy. one. Ah! Yeah, <laughs> Can no, I get it this time? No. <laughs> it's Lodi. Make it a slide. I want to go first. Come on, Ellie. Let me go. Okay, Jimmy. Beat you there. Hey, kids. You might be experts at going down the mega slide, but let's see how Ooh. good you are at going down the mega slide and through the impossible shape. Impossible shapes? How are we supposed to do that? You're gonna use your skill to slide down the slide through the impossible shape without breaking this board. Well, let's see if I can do it. Three, two, one, go! It's your turn. Time to show you how an expert slider does it. Whoa. Let's go. Wow. Go. Wow. Awesome. Oh. Right through. Oh. You're supposed to go straight through without breaking the board. What? You didn't tell me that. It's not fair. I'm ready for round two. You're gonna like this shape. Do you recognize it? It's E for Ellie. <laughs> ready to go? Three, two, one, go! Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Yes! I did it! Holy moly, she did it again. Well done. <laughs> All right. Here comes Jimmy. I did it. I got it. Right through. Actually, your head did touch the board right there. It kind of broke a little. What? No, it didn't. No. Actually, I guess now that you mention it, my head is kind of sore. Let's go to the instant replay. It's time for round three. Awesome. Is our shape. Pizza shaped. Uh, well, it's actually a triangle, but uh, it is the hardest because it gets narrower up here. So watch out, Ellie. Okay. I think I got this one in the back. Three, two, one, and go! Whoa! 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 You did a great job right through. Uh-huh. Jimmy, this one might be a little hard. Good luck. Hard for you, maybe, but not for Jimmy. <laughs> I got this one down. For pizza. Here we go. Oh, 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 oh Jimmy. Oh, oh. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Let, let me try one more try. Uh, I got it this time. Here comes Jimmy! Wow! Ah. Did I win? Uh, does it look like you won? Not quite. You know what? Enough of this game. I'm gonna go have some real pizza. Come on, Jimmy! Actually, you know what? Pizza sounds kind of good. Yeah. See ya, Coach Rocco! Oh, well, save some for me! I'm hungry too! Guess what, everyone? I'm gonna get up to some super slip and slidey fun with Jimmy and Coach Rocco. And we're gonna crash into these pins. <laughs> I love bowling and slip and slide. <laughs> All right, kids, are you ready for today's activities? Yeah. All right, you get two chances. Yeah. Halloween. And this year, I'm dressed up as Firefighter Ellie. By the time I'm done trick-or-treating, this bag will be all filled with candy. <laughs> House number one, let's do this. Let's see what yummy treat they have for us. Trick-or-treat. 
Oh, wow. Cool costume. <laughs> I love Minecraft. So, Ellie, do you know who I am? Hmm, let me guess. Code Rocco? Wrong. It's me, Jimmy. I tricked you. <laughs> you definitely tricked me, Jimmy. Good one. Hey, what are you doing? It's called trick or treat, Ellie. And since I tricked you, that means I get to take one of your treats. Oh, awesome. A full-size Snickers bar. Best Halloween ever. Wait a minute. So you're saying that I have to trick you to get candy? I've never heard of these rules before. Well, that's how it works. But uh, don't count on tricking me. I've never been tricked before, and I don't plan on it happening this year. Guess you'll just have to try again next year. Happy Halloween. Jimmy! Oh, hmm. He says he's never been tricked before. Ha. We'll see about that. Boys and girls, if you want to see Jimmy get tricked, give me a big thumbs up. I'm going to get that candy, Jimmy. Jimmy's always making up rules during the holidays. Huh. He always does this every single time. I wonder what I can do to trick him. Hi, Coach Rocco. What are you doing? Uh, just doing some laundry. Hey, firefighter. That's the best costume I've seen all day. Without any fires lately. <laughs> oh, thanks, Coach Rocco. I like this costume, too. It's my favorite. But Jimmy knew it was me right away, and he has a rule now that if he knows who I am in my costume, that means he gets to take my candy, and I can't have any candy. I never heard of that. Well, I got plenty of clothes and costumes here. We could trick Jimmy all day. I had the perfect thing. Ooh. Try that. Yes. <laughs> oh, and one more thing. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Coach Rocco. I'm going to get so much candy. <laughs> Yay! Howdy, partners! It's me, Cowboy Ellie. Wow, Coach Rocco sure has a lot of interesting costumes. I think I'm gonna definitely trick Jimmy this time. Another trick-or-treater. Here's my chance to get more candy. They'll never know it's me. Trick-or-treat! Well, hey there, Mr. Cowboy. But first, can you guess who I am? Hmm. Well, I reckon you're Jimmy, ain't ya? What? How did you know it was me? <laughs> well, I bet I can guess who you are, too. Let's oh, see. yeah? You got your hat, your mustache, and a horsey. Now, what's your horsey's name? Uh, my horsey's name? My horsey's name's Horsey Rocco. That's it. Rocco the horse. Horsey Rocco, huh? Mm -hmm. Nice try. I knew it was you all along, Coach Rocco. <laughs> I thought you were Coach Rocco. Nope, you thought I was Coach Rocco, but I was Cowboy Ellie the entire time. Oh, very funny. Well, newsflash, I only let you win, and that's just because I felt bad about taking your Snickers bar, which I'm gonna eat right now. Yeah, right, not so fast. This candy bar is mine because you got tricked. <laughs> Maybe I'll come by later and trick you again. <laughs> trick or treat, happy Halloween, Jimmy. Yeah, right. Jimmy never gets tricked twice. I'm not letting that happen again. Fell for the Grandpa Sparkles mm -hmm. costume? 
<laughs> I know! My trick-or-treat basket is so full already! Do you have any more costumes that I can wear? Uh, we're getting low here, but I think I have something. Nope, we've tricked Jimmy so many times, we've used up all the costumes. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Hmm, I want to trick him one last time. What do we do? <gasps> Coach Rocco, do you have that cowboy costume from earlier still? Yeah, it's right here. Okay, and do you think that your shirt would fit me? This? Yeah, why? <laughs> Follow me. I have an idea for the greatest Halloween trick yet. Howdy, I'm Cowboy Ellie. <laughs> and I'm Coach Rocco. <laughs> nice t-shirt, I like it. Thank you really yeah. think he's gonna fall for this? <laughs> oh, I think so. <laughs> Let me just put on my glasses and fix your hat a little bit. Okay. Trick or treat! Trick or treat! <laughs> Coach Rocco, what are you doing trick or treating? How come you didn't wear a costume? Wait a second. Something looks different about you. Oh, new sunglasses. <laughs> Super cool, Coach. And uh, who's your friend here? Oh, that's funny. This is the second cowboy that's trick-or-treated at my house tonight. In fact, you look similar. Same hat, same mustache, same horsey. Hmm, what's your horsey's name? Uh, uh, uh Rocco? <laughs> Rocco the horsey, huh? Nice try, but you gotta get up pretty early in the morning to pull one over Jimmy's head. I know it's you, Ellie Sparkles. Oh, it's Rocco! <laughs> What are you doing? I thought you were... Wait a minute. If you're Coach Rocco... Howdy! Then who are you? It's me! Ellie, Coach! <laughs> Ellie, Coach? Oh, you got me again? <laughs> Trick or treat! Is this where we get all the candy? Yeah. Oh, oh, these are my favorite. Do you have any candy corns, Jimmy? <laughs> Those are my all-time favorite. I put them underneath my pillow and they get nice and soft. And when I wake up in the morning, I just pop one in my head. <laughs> oh, my teeth are killing me. My teeth. for this year because I get to give out all the candy to the people in the neighborhood. I have a huge bowl where I filled up with all sorts of wonderful treats. I can't wait to see all the costumes. They're gonna be so cool. <laughs> oh, it's our first trick or treater already. I wonder who it is. <gasps> trick or treat. Hi, Jimmy. Oh, cool crayon costume. That's super creative. Thanks, Ellie. I got the coolest costume in school per usual, so I can get the most candy. Well, lucky for you, I just filled up my bowl with all sorts of treats. Wow, these are gigantic. I'll take this one and this one, my favorite. And this one, I love these too, and that, no thanks. Ooh, candy, 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 candy. Oh, but Jimmy, because they're full-size bars, you can only pick one. To keep it fair for everyone else, I gotta have some more for the rest of the kids. Only one? Are you sure? Can I have just a couple more? Nope, but I promise you, Jimmy, if I have any leftover candy, we'll share it together. No. Oh. Wait a second. Sure thing, Ellie. Whatever you say, fair's fair after all. I guess I'll just take this one and be on my way. Happy Halloween. Oh. easy. I'm really glad that Jimmy respected my rule of one candy per person. <laughs> trick or treat! Huh, another trick or treater? That was really fast. Trick or treat. Hmm, Jimmy, I know that's you. You just put on glasses and a green crayon costume instead of your blue one. Oh, come on, Ellie. You're the only one in this whole block that gives out full bars. Don't I at least get points for trying a new costume? Jimmy, I'll see you tomorrow at school, and I already told you I'll give you candy if I have any left over. Oh, Ellie, please. Come oh, on, Jimmy. Give me some of that sweet candy. Jimmy. Give me candy, candy. Come on, Ellie. Tomorrow. I'll give, I'll give you leftovers to tomorrow. No. Bye. <laughs> Coach Rocco, Coach Rocco, hey, there you are. <laughs> Ellie's giving out full bars of candy to the trick-or-treaters, but to get another one, I have to change my costume. 
Do you have anything I could use? Oh, uh, well, let's see here. Um, no luck, Jimmy. These are all double costumes, so you'll need a friend to wear it with you. A friend? That's perfect. We can go together. Oh, no. I haven't been uh, trick-or-treating in a long time. Coach Rocco, I'm telling you, these candy bars <laughs> are huge. You've got to join me. That big, huh? Well, let's see what we got here. This ought to do the trick. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh, some lucky person is going to be getting Reese's Kiss. I haven't been happy before. And Hershey's with almonds. Oh, I'm so excited. I haven't trick-or-treated in years. Now remember, your ketchup, I mustard. And if anyone asks, this is our first time being here. OK, all right, all right. Kit Kats. Ooh, ooh, peanut butter cups, classic. Oh, <laughs> trick or treaters are here! Trick or treat! Oh, uh, hi! <laughs> Ketchup and mustard! That's a super funny costume! Oh, hi, Coach Rocco! Oh, you know it was me? <laughs> yeah, of course! Uh, well, you always go as ketchup for Halloween. Oh, that's true. Well, Coach Rocco's back trick or treating, and <laughs> I'm ready for some yummy treats! <laughs> Close your eyes and reach into the bowl and whatever you pick out is the candy that you keep. Ooh, okay, I'll go first. <laughs> All right, I love games. It's a huge candy bar, best Halloween ever. <laughs> My turn. <laughs> okay. What? Oh, you got a banana. You're gonna have a healthy Halloween. It looks delicious and it matches your costume. Yeah. <laughs> well, you ready to hit some more houses, Mr. Mustard? No, no. <laughs> well, no. happy Halloween, you guys. I hope you get tons of candy from the other houses. You're only allowed one treat here. I gotta save the rest for everybody else. <laughs> Bye, Ellie. Happy Bye. Halloween. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was nice, wasn't it? I wonder who that Mr. Mustard was. Great teamwork, Jimmy. You were right. These candy bars are huge. <laughs> Great for you. You got a candy bar. All I got was this banana. Nobody wants a fruit on Halloween. I think since it was my idea, we should trade. Uh, I don't think so. In all my days of trick-or-treating, I've never seen candy bars this huge. Look, it's as big as your head. <laughs> Sweet, delicious, chocolatey candy goodness. That's it, Coach. We have to go back there and try again. I gotta get one of those candy bars. Do you have any other costumes? Well, I do have one costume left, but I don't think you're gonna like it. What? No way. Uh-uh. How are we even gonna fit into that? I don't think so, Coach. Trick or treat! Trick or treat! <laughs> It looks so real. And there's two people in the costume? That's awesome. You put so much work into it. And because you put so much work into your Halloween costume, you can have the rest of my candy. Well, I have an orange, and I have this huge candy bar. So who wants the orange? No. No? Then who wants the candy bar? Oh, me, 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 me. I want it. No, I want it. You got the last one. You should get the orange, Jimmy. Orange is your favorite color. Coach Rocco, it's my turn to get a candy. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Jimmy, Coach Rocco, it was you two in the horse costume. How many times have you been trick-or-treating here today? The jig is up! Oh, run. Run. <laughs> Jimmy, Coach Rocco! Oh, well, I guess this is all for me then. And... <laughs> I get a free horse head. They left all their candy here, too. So silly. Now here. Hey, Jimmy, have you been leaving your toys out in the yard again? No, -uh, not me, I swear. Hey, it looks like there's a trail of presents. I say we follow them. Good idea. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Jimmy. Could that really be him? Santa's hat. 
Santa's coat, and that's the real Santa. It's him. <laughs> there, there, Rudolph. Calm down. A nice pat on the head always made me feel better. <laughs> In fact, I'll pat myself right now. Ouchie! I really hurt myself when I ran into that branch over there. <laughs> Santa hit his head. I don't think he remembers that it's Christmas. Come on, we should probably help him out. Let's see if he's okay. Hey, Santa, shouldn't you get out of the pool? It's almost Christmas time. Christmas? I love Christmas. I can't wait to see what the Easter Bunny has brought for me. Oh, 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 oh. you okay? All right, let's give you a fun quiz to see if you're ready for Christmas Eve. So, where do you live? Hawaii with all my reindeer. <laughs> no, Santa, you live in the North Pole with Mrs. Claus. The North Pole? I never heard of it. Is that near Hawaii? Hold on, let's try another question. Okay, Santa, what do you do every year on Christmas Eve? Oh, Christmas Eve, that's easy. I uh, watch a lot of TV, I play Roblox, and then I... Or sleep on the couch eating a bag of popcorn. <laughs> No, Santa, you deliver all the presents to the boys and girls on Christmas Eve. Jimmy, this is way worse than I thought. He's forgotten everything about Christmas. You know what? I think I have a great idea. Santa, Santa school. school! Boys and girls, if you want to go to Santa school with the real Santa Claus, give us a big thumbs up. <laughs> okay, we'll see you inside, Santa. All right. <laughs> Come on, Rudolph! Welcome to your first day of Santa school. Santa helpers Ellie and Jimmy at your service. Now the first lesson is, we have to change into your Santa costume. The first thing you're gonna need is your big red cozy coat. It's how everyone recognizes you. You mean Santa doesn't wear a Hawaiian shirt? Oh, well, this is cozy though. <laughs> <laughs> Santa also doesn't wear sunglasses. <laughs> he needs his reading glasses so he can read his naughty and nice list. Oh, yes. That is much better. <laughs> Don't forget your famous Santa hat. Oh, this. Now this is familiar. I know what's going on here. Ho, 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 ho. We're celebrating a birthday party. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> oh. No, it's not anybody's birthday, Santa. Anyway, Santa also needs to have his big black belt. Do you know where this goes, Santa? Oh, yes. This one I do know. It goes right here at top of my head. There you go. Oh, no. This is going to be the longest day of school ever. <laughs> All right, Santa. It's time for your next lesson, music class. We're going to teach you to sing one of the most famous Christmas songs there is. Oh, don't worry about this one, Jimmy. I got it. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. No, no Santa, not the itsy bitsy spider. It's Jingle Bells. Now, here, Ellie will sing it to you. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Hey! Uh, Smirkle there, smirkle there, smirkle there, smirkle there. No, 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 Santa. Repeat after me. Jingle, jingle, bells, bells, jingle bells, smirk on Oh, no, 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 I see what you're doing wrong. Now let's take this slowly. Jingle, jingle, bells, bells. Now put it together and say jingle bells. Smirk on oh. oh, no, this plan isn't working. We're going to have to regroup and find out another plan to save Christmas. Be right back, Santa. What the heck's a smirkle there anyway? Smirkle there, smirkle there, smirkle, smirkle there. <laughs> smirkle there. Oh. What's your name?
right, Santa, you're going to learn one of the most important lessons of the day. You're going to learn how to put the presents underneath the Christmas tree without waking anybody up. And I'll show you how to do it. First, you gotta take your presents, then you gotta carefully glide through all these lasers, dodging them, and make sure you're as quiet as possible. Because if you touch even one of these lasers or make too big of a sound, the Christmas alarm will go off. And we don't want that to happen. Let's see. And clear. Well done, Jimmy. <laughs> see, Santa? Super easy. Remember, nice and quiet. Got it. Nice and quiet. Here goes. Oh. This is hard work. Do you have any snacks around here? Yeah. Santa, why don't you eat your milk and cookies that I got for you? And I'll be over there thinking about your next lesson. Milk and cookies. I've never had that before. Hmm. It actually tastes kind of familiar. Of course, milk and cookies is my favorite snack. <laughs> I remember now. I remember. <laughs> coming through, coming through. Santa's got gifts to deliver. <laughs> Santa? Piece of cake. Yeah. Ho, 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 ho. This is fun. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 ho. I feel like a spry spring chicken. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Piece of cake. Santa, you did it! You passed through without triggering any alarms. I think you passed Santa school. Just one more question to make sure you're back to normal. What is Santa's favorite Christmas song? Good question, Jimmy. Could it be? Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Ha, 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 ha. Merry Christmas! Ha, ha, ha. Oh, 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 oh. What's up, Sparkle Squad? Me and Jimmy have been playing a lot this morning, and now we're super hungry. I wonder what we're going to have for lunch today. Oh, maybe we can get some pizza. Ooh, that's a great idea. Hey, Coach, can we get some pizza for takeout? Takeout? Look at all the food that's in here. We have a lot of food that needs to get used up. So how about we make some lunchtime smoothies? You can make an orange smoothie, you can make a red smoothie. You each could use five ingredients and um, let's see who makes the best one. Jimmy, you're gonna get beat. Awesome, an orange smoothie? That's my favorite color, so there's no way I'm losing this challenge. <laughs> Wait a second. What's orange? Coach Rocco, there's no food that's orange. This is impossible. Aw, oh, come on. Hmm, let's see. Here's some oranges. Of course. Let's plop a couple in there. Baby carrots. I know what this needs. Cheetos, my favorite. Mm. Cheetos. Yum. Hmm. I know what it's missing. Mac and cheese. That's kind of orange. The cheese, at least. Yum. This is going to be the cheesiest so smoothie ever. <laughs> hmm. Let's see what else we got in the fridge. Mustard's kind of orange, right? Close enough, I'd say. <laughs> Little mustard on it. This smells good already. Let's blend it up. 
Okay. <laughs> and... All right, let's pour it out. Got the cup ready? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. And it smells delicious. <laughs> oh, that looks scrumptious. How about we split it three ways? Uh, On you second can thought. Go first, coach. Yeah, you can be the taste tester. Oh, all right, all right. All right. More for me. <laughs> mm, this smells interesting. Mm. Oh, this is coach. No, it's um, it's um, a little gritty. <laughs> Must be the carrot. Oh yeah, <clears throat> but it's delicious and nutritious, coach. You gotta love it. Yeah. Yes, um, um, excuse me a second. <laughs> All right, I still need yours, Ellie. No <laughs> problem. I think he loved it. Poor coach Rocco. Hmm. Now I have to make my smoothie. Yeah. I think I'll put in some apples, some strawberry jelly. There's not much in there. There is this tomato sauce. Tomatoes are fruit. Mmm, I love strawberry jelly. You know, Ellie, I don't think that's quite red enough. Let's get another ingredient. Mm. Pepperoni. It's good on pizza. Surely it'll be just as good in a smoothie. You know what? Let's just throw a couple. I'm not so sure about this, Jimmy. Well, to top it off and make it perfect, I found some hot sauce to give it a little spice, you know? Oh, there you go. There we go. Oh, that was a lot of hot sauce, Jimmy. The more the merrier. Okay, time to blend. Nice! Lovely! Chunky. Mm-hmm. Hey, Coach! My smoothie's ready for you! Oh, I feel much better, and I'm... A little bit hungry, so um, would you like it? You're Taste gonna love it, it Coach. No, it's no, no, I'm good. Oh, all, right, all for you, Coach. Bottom it up. <laughs> it's a little bit spicy, isn't it? It's a. Uh, <laughs> 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 Oh, do you need more? Oh, no. Are you sure? I need, I need some, I need to have water, water. I need to water? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Here, I'll just drink this. Oh. Oh, that's your, that's your smoothie. That's good. Oh, God. Yes, yes, yes. How about we have um, ice cream for lunch today? Yes, yes. Yeah. Oh, awesome. oh. Oh, God. Hey, Coach. Coach? Rocco, I was just having the best dream. You should have seen it. You've overslept again the fifth time this camp. You're gonna have to learn to follow directions. Oh, Coach Rocco, Jimmy will follow directions just fine. Today, we're gonna try a new activity, the Say Yes Challenge. Yes. Jimmy, you're gonna have to say yes to Ellie for the next 24 hours. What? Anything but that. Coach Rocco, I'm sorry, but Ellie's right, I won't sleep in again. Come on, tell him, Ellie. So let me get this right. Jimmy has to say yes to everything I ask him for the next day? Yes! In that case, I think that Jimmy could actually learn a little lesson. <laughs> oh. 
Come on. Best day ever. More like worst day ever. <laughs> Jimmy, am I glad to see you. Can you help me blow up these pool floats? What? No way. I was just about to go for a swim. That's crazy. You do remember what Coach Rocco said about saying yes to me all day. No. <laughs> so I'll take that as a yes? Yes, Ellie. Perfect. You did great. Now I'm gonna go inside and I'll see you later. Remember, no playing. Yeah, remember, no playing. Oh, the drinks. <laughs> I feel dizzy already. Look how big this thing is. You need the lungs of an elephant to blow all these up. Time for a shortcut. Awesome. See how much quicker that was? This is why Jimmy's the smartest kid in camp. Hey, wait a second. This gives me an idea. to be blowing up the floats. I am not Jimmy, I'm a giant hamster. Ha <laughs> ha, uh -huh. I get it Jimmy, you're a hamster in a hamster ball. But you said that you were supposed to blow up these floats, now come on. Sorry, but I don't think I can blow up anything while I'm in here. That is, unless you think you can catch me. Come and get me, Ellie. So you're saying we're gonna play tag and if I catch you, you're finally gonna blow them up? Yep. Fine, you're on. Oh, I'm gonna have so many floats for you to blow up by the time I catch you. a great game of tag. Oh, and well done on blowing up all these floats. Oh, thanks, Ellie. Yeah, super fun. Well, after that, I'm exhausted. Well, I'm gonna go make some lunch. Oh, that's a great idea. You know what? I'm getting hungry, too. Hey, how about making me something to eat as well? You know I have to say <laughs> yes to you all day, so yes, I'll make you something to eat. But lucky for me, I happen to love cooking. In fact, I'm the best chef in the whole camp. I didn't know you liked to cook, Jimmy. Okay, Mr. Chef, why don't you make me something delicious? Something you think I'll like. Perfect. One Ellie special coming right up. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. What can Chef Jimmy make Ellie? Well, I always see her drinking those green smoothies. And there's a blender right here. Maybe I'll make her my own green smoothie. Hmm. What ingredient should we use first? It's got to be something green and healthy. Let's see what they got in here. Spinach, perfect. Delicious, nutritious, and most importantly, green. No, I think we need something greener. How about a little seaweed, fresh from the ocean? Yum, yum, it's starting to smell good already. Hmm, but we should add some fruit. I don't know if we have any though. I got it, fruity gummy worms. It's the next best thing. And these are some of my favorite candies. And hmm. Get a little more liquid in there. I got it. Some pickle juice. Complete with pickles, of course. Awesome. And as a special finishing touch to get those big camper muscles, an egg. This is gonna be so good. Let's blend it up. Yum! All done, and it smells delicious. Let's pour it out. Mmm. Ah, perfect. Oh, Ellie, I finished your smoothie. Oh, wow, Jimmy, thanks. Wow, how did you know I love a green smoothie? It gives me all the energy I need for camp activities. Yep, and this has fruit in it and veggies and even a few special Chef Jimmy secret ingredients. 
Ooh. Ah, oh, Jimmy, what did you put in here? It kind of smells like a camp garbage can. Yeah. Thank you so much, but I think I'll pass. Mm, it's super green, just how you like it. Oh, is that one of those healthy smoothies you're always drinking, Ellie? Mm. Here you go, Coach Rocco. Try it. It's delicious and nutritious. Mm. Coach, I wouldn't drink that if I were. Mm. Oh, no! Oh. Ugh. Mmm. Interesting. <laughs> and tangy. <laughs> and a bit uh, chewy. <laughs> You're right, Jimmy. I, I feel an energy boost coming on. <laughs> Coach, are you okay? I'm just going to go with that. Uh, vacuum the lawn. <laughs> Okay, bye, Coach. Glad you liked it. Have fun vacuuming the lawn. I told you it was good. All right, campers, as you may know, tonight is the biggest night of camp yet. The Roblox Tournament of Champions. Yes! yes! Roblox, Roblox Tournament! Tournament. Awesome. awesome! But there'll be no Roblox playing as long as this camp is such a mess. So I'm going to need you two campers to get this place in tip-top shape. I mean, this place has to be spotless. Don't worry, Coach Rocco. We'll get this place clean in no time. Yep, don't you worry. Ellie will clean the whole place up. <laughs> That's the spirit. I mean it. Keep this room clean. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I'm going to go to my room to practice Roblox for the tournament. See ya. Wait a second, Jimmy. Stay right here. We have to get this place clean before you can practice. I'll tell you what. Why don't you... Set up this tent for outdoor camping. I mean, can you set up this tent? You do remember the challenge rules, don't you? Yes, I remember the rules. Okay, fine, I'll take care of the tent, but after that I'm going up to my room to practice. Deal? Deal. Just because I have to say yes to Ellie all day, she thinks that she's the boss. Well, I'll show her who the real boss at camp is. You know what? Change of plans. Tonight we're gonna camp indoors instead of outdoors. All done. Wow, this is even cooler than I thought. Coach Rocco and Ellie gotta see this. Hey coach, Ellie, come on, you gotta see this. This is why I'm the best camper ever. <laughs> He's gonna love this. Ta-da! What do you think? It's a... Uh... Is this a tent? In the room that I told you to keep spotless? In the room I was gonna win the Roblox Championship. Don't worry, Coach Rocco. Um, Jimmy and I will clean this up in no time. It's just a couple tables, a couch, and we can take this all outside. It'll be so easy. <laughs> Don't worry. Yep, yep, in no time, just like Ellie said. Mm -hmm. Well, that's the camp spirit, just like I taught you. <laughs> all right, I'll see you campers later. Have a blast. <laughs> Phew. I thought Coach Rocco was going to be mad at me. Well, thanks a lot, Ellie. I owe you one. Yeah, you definitely do, Jimmy. Hey, what about one more day of you saying yes to me? That should do it. What? No, not in a million years. <laughs> Please, Ellie, anything but that. No way. Hey, Sparkle Squad. We were supposed to go outside for camp activities today. But it's raining outside. I hate rain, it ruins everything. Awesome! It's raining outside? Rain? I love it when it rains. That means no camp activities today. It's like a snow day at school. I can do whatever I want all day. Rain dance time. <laughs> Not so fast, Jimmy. We don't have any snow days or rain days here at Coach Rocco's camp. So since we can't do any activities outside, we're gonna do something inside. The last to leave your bedroom challenge. What? Bedroom? 
You cannot take a step outside of your bedroom all day. And to make things more interesting, I'm going to give you each $200 to buy things online. But make sure you only buy things to help you with your challenge. Here's your tablets. There you go. Start shopping! <laughs> My package finally came! Let's see what I got. I picked some really awesome things, just you wait and see. The first thing is... Yes! My Robux gift card for $50! Look at that! Oh man, with this $50, I can finally get into the VIP server for Meep City. And I can get the French braid for my avatar. <laughs> I can play Roblox all day. And now for the coolest room in the whole house, Jimmy's room. I ordered this huge box of stuff online, but honestly, I don't even really need it. I can stay in my bedroom all day anyway. All I need is my bed and my basketball. Now, can Ellie do that? I don't think so. Let me show you some of the stuff that I bought online. Pool goggles, awesome. Water guns, super awesome. And lastly, check this out. It's my very own sea scooter. This cost me $150, so it was almost all of my money, but it's totally worth it. All I have to do is hold on to it and it takes me underwater, like my own personal submarine. I gotta see this baby in action. Let's quietly go to the pool. Going somewhere, Jimmy? Ah, Coach Rocco, what are you doing here? Huh? What is this? Goggles, a sea scooter? Are you on your way to the swimming pool already? Because you know what happens once you step foot outside this bedroom. You go to the channel! Got it, Coach Rocco. We can't leave the bedroom. Nope, definitely not going to the pool, Coach. Just uh, getting a little fresh air is all. <laughs> There's no way I'm letting Ellie beat me in this challenge. Atta boy, that's the spirit. <laughs> Bloxburg is a great game on Roblox, but I think I'm going to take a break. Let's see what else I have. Whoa, it's my makeup kit. Ooh, I've been waiting for this one. Let's see what's inside. <laughs> it's got blush and lip glosses. Ooh, and on the sides, there's eyeshadows and highlighters. Oh, where do I even start? Hmm, I'm gonna take this brush. I'm gonna do a little bit of blush. Time to try out a new look. All done. I love my new look. This calls for a selfie. I have a great idea. Jimmy hates it when I put on makeup, so I'm gonna send this selfie to him. <laughs> hey, Jimmy, do you like my makeup? You want me to do yours? <laughs> and set. Oh, hey, I got a text. This must be super important. Hi, Jimmy. Do you like my makeup? Want me to do yours? Ew! Jimmy definitely does not wear makeup. L-O-L, Ellie. You're so funny. Not. <laughs> Send. So it turns out that this sea scooter really isn't that fun if I have to stay up in my room. But luckily, I had lots of other money left over so I could buy more cool stuff. Like this. A tent. I've always wanted to set up a tent in my bedroom. Now's my chance. 
Uh-oh. This is a little bigger than I thought. I think they sent the wrong tent. Or maybe I should have measured. There we go. So this is what it's like having a tent in your room. This is super awesome. Now I can just sit here in my tent and fly around. Ellie would totally be jealous if she saw me right now. Hey, Ellie, you should check out this awesome tent that I set up in my bedroom. No need for me to leave. I'm going to be in here all day. You bought a tent? That doesn't make sense. Jimmy, I hope you bought some food as well because you're going to need it. Oh, I really am so hungry, especially now that I know that Jimmy's being really silly. Oh, but I can't go to the kitchen. So I ordered my lunch, my favorite too. <laughs> Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. And because I usually get really hungry, I got more than one. <laughs> and I even got a drink. Yellow Gatorade matches my shirt. <laughs> hey, Jimmy, I got some extra food if you want some. Peanut butter and jelly? Yeah, right. I know you're just trying to trick me. Nice try, Ellie. But Jimmy was smart enough to buy all of his favorite foods, like chips and chips and more chips. You name it, Jimmy bought it. Uh-oh, though. There's nothing to drink. Oh, did I get anything to drink? Oh, no. All that's left in the box is rope from the tent. What am I going to do? I'm already getting thirsty. Hmm. I need to get to the kitchen to get a drink, but I'm not allowed to leave the room. I got it. What if I tie up the rope inside my room somewhere and then tie the other end of it around my waist? That way, I'll still technically be connected to my room because I'm connected to the rope, which is connected to my room. Now, I know what you're thinking. Jimmy, you're the smartest kid ever. And you're right. Come on, let's go. <laughs> What are you doing outside of your room? Did you give up already? No, I didn't give up. I'm not technically out of my room. You see, one end of this rope is connected to my room, and the other end is connected to me, so I'm technically still in my room. <laughs> hmm, that Jimmy, he's always trying to cheat. Wait a minute, this gives me a great idea. <laughs> I did get an arts and crafts set with scissors because I was going to do some crafts later. But I think this is an even better idea. <laughs> ah, I made it to the kitchen. My plan worked, like usual. Finally, something to drink. Ah, now that's refreshing. Coach here. Oh, making sure everybody's following the rules by staying in their rooms. Well, well, I can explain. You see, the other end of this rope is connected to my room, so technically I'm still in my room. And well, it's not anymore. Hi. That means you left your room. I don't know that happened, Coach Rocco. I swear it was connected to my room. Oh, Ellie, you can come down now. No, 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 Coach, please don't give this badge to Ellie. I'll, I'll stay in my room for two days. Two whole days. That and um, I have a sea scooter if you want it. And all the candy you can have. Hi. Huh? Well, I just found Jimmy here outside of his room hanging out in the kitchen. So that means you have won the challenge. Here is your 24 hours stay in your bedroom challenge badge. Yay! Don't be sad, Jimmy. Oh, guess what? I have another PB&J for you and a makeup kit. I'm thinking I'm gonna give you a makeover. How would you like that? That 